everyone, it's Leah here from Kids AM and it is Monday and uh, I, you may have realized that I have not posted a video um, in the last few days. Um, we've been busy here in England getting our space door shop back in business and uh, so we've been uh, cleaning and uh, rearranging and getting ready to welcome people back and we've been able to do that today which was really fun. Um, but I wanted to uh, be able to share a little bit of something with the kids today and so I'm gonna teach you guys a fun way to learn about the phases of the moon. So I was looking for ideas and I found this fun and tasty way to learn about uh, the phases of the moon using these chocolate sandwich cookies, um, sometimes called Oreos. And uh, so yeah, I'm gonna just go over it really quick. Now, this wasn't the easiest um, thing to do because uh, they didn't break off as uh, cleanly as I would have liked and as shown in some of the pictures I found. Um, so it was a little tricky, but um, eventually I got to enough to fill the eight spaces and without broken cookies. Um, so it was a little bit messy, but it can be done and you can always eat what breaks and what doesn't work. So that's the fun part of this project. Um, but this is the new moon. So when you, it's very dark and you don't see any light on it at all in the sky, which is actually happening again on Father's Day, this Sunday, 21st of June, which is also summer solstice. Um, you'll see a dark moon and then a few days later you will see this waxing crescent see the crescent shape then it moves to the first quarter moon looks like a half moon but it's called the first quarter moon and it, you'll see that it goes counterclockwise and then this one is called the waxing gibbous phase Okay, so here we have the full moon, which I believe the next full moon will be on the 5th of July. And then you'll see it move towards the waning gibbous phase, the third quarter moon. And then lastly is the waning crescent. And then it goes back to a new moon, and that's the phases of our moon shown in cookies. And then you can do the fun, fun, fun part and maybe crumble them over some ice cream and have dessert. So I hope that was a fun activity for you today to learn about the phases of the moon. Look out for that new moon coming on Sunday, summer solstice the 21st of June and um, once you when you look up into the sky then you will know what these phases are called and that's really exciting so uh, we'll hopefully see you soon on Kids AM. Have a good week!